Hey, what is up guys? DRC3 here, back with another My Hero Ultra Impact video, and today we have some all new character stories to go over. We have the new Dobby story, we also have the new Hawk story, as well as the new Tetsu Tetsu story, the Monoma story, the Kendo story, and the new overhaul story to go over. So a bunch of stories to go over. Let's go ahead and hop in. Holiday story, Dobby's day off. After the conflict with the Shi Hasekai, Dobby gathered allies to expand the League of Villains. I went all over the place, but all I found was trash. I want to find at least one decent one. Seems like it might take a while. I'm beat. Is that an abandoned building? Perfect. I've been stuck with the League members for a while now. They're so noisy, it gets so annoying. I can rest alone here for today at least. Huh? Phone call. Yuran, did you find a good... Yo, Dobby! I see you're working hard to find allies, you lazy trash. So noisy, so it's you. What do you want? I'm just checking how things are going with you. The ally search going okay? Most certainly not. I can't even find a single potential ally. What? What the heck are you doing? Are you really searching? No worries if you aren't. Are you talking with Dobby? Another noisy one. Oh, Toga! Dobby says he can't find any new allies. Really? Well, we're having trouble gathering cash, too. What? You haven't found any money? We trashed this big mansion, but there wasn't any cash. We're trying our best, but the League of Villains is still super poor. You're completely useless, aren't you? No. You shouldn't talk. Lay it on us. You don't like to chat much, do you, Dobby? Want to change jobs with us? I am more suited to being a scout than you two. But you can't even find any allies. I can, but I choose not to. I don't really care about doctrines, but... We don't need trash that just live without any sort of code. Don't you agree? Oh yeah, great point. You're the one who is trash. <laughs> Tomura wouldn't like it if we got some weirdos. I'm gonna hang up if there's nothing else. Okay, feel free to call again if you get lonely. I won't. See ya. Unbelievable. No matter where I go, that noisy bunch barges in. Now I don't even want to rest. Guess I'll get back to work. And that is the end of Dobby's story. It wasn't really a, a, a holiday, a day off, but I mean, I, it was kind of a day off. He got to go to an abandoned building, but you know, we'll take it. Holiday story, Hawks' day off. I am excited for this story. I hope it's actually a day off. I'm excited to see what Hawks does on his day off, but uh, it's probably not gonna be a day off realistically because you know, pro heroes never rest apparently. It's gotten dark while I was doing all this paperwork. I guess it's dinner time now. Thud. Did something just fall? Sounds like it came from the vacant lot. Okay, so we have Tokoyami. It's so good. It's not working. I still can't fly at will. Oh, Tokoyami. I was wondering what was going on. What are you doing here? Hawks. I'm training so hard that I can fly as soon as possible. Ah, flying practice. You're still hard at work even though it's your day off. I will not be de defeated by my own inexperience. Huh, you're always so serious. Mind if I stay and watch you train? Huh? Sure. Let's go, Dark Shadow. And they crash again. Ugh, once more. He's getting his balance right, and he is able to pull off some complex movements, but... I can see you're getting tired. Your posture is slipping. That's... That's right. I know you want to learn to fly right now, but there's no point in rushing. You need to train more efficiently. If you keep pushing yourself, your goal will be harder to reach. Also, if you do want to fly, you'll need to rest. I see. Okay, I'll put an end to today's training. Good, the next time I'm free, I'll practice with you. Now I'm going to go grab dinner. If you haven't eaten yet, do you want to come? No, not yet. Are you sure? Yay. All right, there's this really great fried chicken place nearby. 
Or would you prefer yakitori? I know a good place. Do you like liver tokoyami? I'll eat it, but I also don't mind fried chicken. Do you like chicken hawks? Mm -hmm. Huh. Boiled, roasted, or fried? I love it all. <laughs> Sometimes I get called a cannibal. <laughs> That's something I've also been called. Huh? Really? Must be a Birdman thing. Well, you must be hungry. Let's head to the restaurant and talk more. Oh, that was kind of cute. That was a nice Bonnie experience. And it makes sense. I like, they came up with a unique story for that one. They uh, get called cannibals for eating birds. But you know what? Uh, we'll take it. Holiday story. Tetsu, 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 Tetsu's day off. Try saying that one three times fast. Wow. All right, so we have Tetsu, 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 Tetsu. Ah, <laughs> that was delicious. Spinach is a great source of iron. Ooh, since I ate some rice too, I'm gonna train hard today. Now, where to start? Yeah, if only I upped my agility and endurance at the training camp, I would have caught that gas using Brad straight away and reduced the damage. Whoa, today I'm gonna train my agility and endurance to the max. I'll use my quirk and run. Ugh. No unusual activity here either. Today's patrol has been so uneventful. It's getting dark. Time to round up the... Huh? I can hear something. It's coming from the gym. Let's go see what's going on. Ah, this is tough. I'm running low on iron. Oh no, I feel like I'm going to collapse. Not today, I gotta go beyond my limit. Gotta keep pushing. This is wow, Tetsu Tetsu. Mr. Vlad! It's a day off and here's my student practicing all by himself until this time of the day. But you have class tomorrow, so it's important to rest up and not push yourself too hard. I'm sorry, please allow me to train a bit longer. Ah. During that incident, if I had been stronger, I could have saved everyone. I want to be able to protect everyone when things happen. Oi. The incident at the training camp. But you saved Kendo and the others. Thank you. But I have still got so far to go. Class A has gotten stronger and overcome heaps of obstacles. I need to push my limits too. I'm not finished yet. Tetsu Tetsu. So, Mr. Vlad, please. I have such a good student. But Tetsu Tetsu, I've said it before, if you destroy your body, it's all for nothing. We heroes must be ready for any emergency, so we need to be prepared at all times. Oh, right! What if an incident happened now? That's right, but I do understand your concern and admire your spirit. You can have another 30 minutes. I'll be watching you from here, but if you get hurt, I'm going to stop you. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mr. Vlad! Okay, last 30 minutes, I'm gonna give it my all. That was a good one. Holiday story, Nieto Monoma's day off. I probably said that wrong and I apologize, but it is what it is, right? Okay, so we have Shinso with them this time. <sighs> this is still not good enough. I've heard the rumors, but he really does practice alone. I need to apply what I've learned from training once more. Hey, looks like you're working hard on your day off. Monoma, are you here to train? Yeah, I didn't expect to see you here, though. Here, have this. I bought too many. A sports drink. Thanks. How about you take a break? You must have been going all morning. Sure, I will. Phew. It's good. It's unsettling when you're being nice to me, Monoma. Since we just happen to bump into each other, let's take a short break and try to get to know each other. We may, after all, be in the same class next year. Ah. So that's how it is. Are you looking forward to next year, Shinso? Yeah. I am, but right now I'm under a lot of pressure. The joint class battle made me realize how inexperienced I am. If I transfer to the hero course, I'll need to catch up to everyone else's level. <laughs> if you're so worried, you can always come to class B. I don't know much about class A, but the members of class B are all friendly. Is that so? Yeah, and class B has Kendo. The class president is very helpful. She's always ready to settle any disputes in the classroom. True. She certainly kept everyone together during the joint class battle. Tetsu Tetsu is hot-headed and easy to get on with. And then there's Yunagi, Kodai, and Shota. Not to mention all the others who you also fought together with. And then 
then there's me. As I said before, I like you. So no need to worry. Class B will do our very best to welcome you. I see. Well, thanks. That helps. If you were to transfer to Class B, we could take down Class A together. <laughs> but if I get into Class A, what are you going to do about it? What a dumb question. I'll think about it when the time comes. Holiday story. Itsuka Kendo's day off. All right, so we have Kendo in a school uniform. The school festival is almost here. I'm going to enter the beauty pageant, but the contestants need to perform on stage. What should I do? Oh, what's the matter, Kendo? You're looking unusually bleak. Oh, Kendo, what's the matter? I've been thinking about what kind of performance to do at the beauty pageant. That's easy. Do what you're good at. How about splitting blocks, stack up some thick blocks, and smash them to bits? No, no, that kind of thing doesn't belong at a beauty pageant. Somebody. Really? I bet it'll be an intense performance. I don't want it to be intense. I'll be wearing a nice dress, so I have to do something ladylike. Tetsu Tetsu's not wrong, though. Huh? What? You think so too, Monoma? Mm. Well, a demure and ladylike performance doesn't suit you. <laughs> Maybe consulting with you guys was a mistake? No, you misunderstood us. We're being serious. You put on a gorgeous dress and smash those blocks to pieces? It's not out of place at all. It'll set you apart from the rest. People will always be drawn to something that's a bit different. Is that so? Well, it'll certainly be surprising. That's what Tetsu Tetsu was trying to say too, right? No, I wasn't thinking that far ahead. <laughs> Kendo, your best quality is your power, so when you start smashing those blocks, the audience will recognize it too. I see. I do feel that it would be beneficial to show some more of my normal self. Besides, I'm sure the audience will like it more than if I were somebody else. Yeah, that's it. It's going to be a blast. I'm sure of it. Thanks for your advice, guys. I think I know what to do. Okay. There's no need to thank us. I hope you win the pageant. <laughs> Kendo, if you do win, the whole world will know Class B's excellence. <sighs> That's why they made me apply. Winning is good and all, but if you're having fun, the audience will see that too. Good luck, Kendo. Mm. Yeah, thanks for the advice, you guys. Yes. I'll do my best to make sure that everyone enjoys watching. Holiday story, overhauls a day off. The final story of this video, we got Overhaul before his uh, unfortunate encounter with Shigaraki. Here we go. Looks like the villains have formed little groups to commit petty crimes all over the place. Then we have Shin Nimoto. I didn't even know his name up to now. I completely forgot it. As you stated earlier, it would appear this is due to All Might and All for One disappearing. Even so, everything they do is just so small I'd understand if they were aiming to take the next top spot somebody help they took my bag phew man it sure was easier to do this with more people Sorry about it. with so many hands you could do something so much bigger let me take those unuseful hands away huh what are you ah my hands they're gone what a wonderful quirk as always so quick, I couldn't see it. Ah, robber in the store. <sighs> uh, again, it's busier than usual today. Purse snatching is petty theft. How insignificant. Oh, it seems that the robbers are running this way. Out of the way, I'm going to run over you. Every last one of them. <sighs> what? Ah, my hands. Sigh. Hey. Grab the money they stole. Yes, sir. What? My hands are back. These petty criminals have really grown in numbers. So much filth working together without some big goal is just a disease. The top hero and villain could disappear, and all of a sudden this disease is out in the open. We must be the ones to cure society of this disease. No one else. 
You are absolutely correct. I imagine that is going to work well as a cure. That's it for our patrol. Let's head back and keep working on the medicine. And that is the end of the stories. I kind of enjoyed that one with overhaul. Let me know what story was your favorite down in the comments, guys. And if you enjoyed the video, please go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. And thank you guys for watching. Peace.